what's up guys welcome to the channel i guess i'll start my channel back up uh kind of bored so i'm gonna find something to do and i guess i'll start youtube again heck my buddy's doing it he has a new youtube channel jake roberts go search him up on youtube and go to sub and like his videos but yeah i guess i'll start mine up too well we got something new to the channel but i'm getting a garden uh we're having us a garden this year we're gonna plant like tomatoes maybe onion like green onion uh lots of things we can grow uh, we might even grow some watermelon or uh it's too late for the potatoes you're supposed to grow them in the winter or something i think i don't know much about growing stuff but i we're definitely gonna grow some tomatoes and uh yeah can't wait to see it and uh i'm sure y'all can't either but today we're probably gonna go right around and uh i probably go do a little fishing or just I don't know if I'm gonna go fish or not, but I'll probably just do a little bit of something, you know. Well, guys, uh, in class, I'm growing some tomatoes, and uh, we cut the plants off, and we took the rest of the tomatoes home. Uh, we just brought in, so there were some red tomatoes, there's some green ones sitting right there, and uh, they, they're done, so we done took them inside. We just gotta let these sit. That one's turning, and uh, that one's still green. So we're gonna let them sit for about another few days or a week or whatever. And, uh, yeah. And now let's go find something to do, like riding or fishing or something. And there's wasps flying everywhere. Oh, okay, whatever. Let's go find something to do. I'll show you my four-wheelers. Uh, that's my dad's over there. It's a, that's a Rubicon Honda 500. Yeah, it's a little dirty because I've been riding it. Now here's my Honda Rancher 350. This is a 2000. This is a 2006 model, and that's a 2017 model. So that's definitely a big age difference. Uh, yeah, I just cleaned this one up. I ain't rode it in about a week, so it's a little dusty, you know. My cat likes to sleep on it for some reason. And that one I use. It's a little muddy. I need to wash it again, you know. But yeah, that's them. And this is my grandpa's old Ford uh, welding truck. It's a, it's a Ford, I think it's, it's a 1971 model, flatbed, humongous gas tank. Oh, there's a wasp inside of it, and there's the inside. Yeah, that's the inside. And we're also having a fish fry tonight. And oh, there's my American flag, I'm proud of that thing. But anyway, uh, we're having a fish fry tonight. We're gonna cook some fish that we caught about a while ago. We, all, we actually went like last weekend, we caught some be it we caught like five big ones and the rest are small we threw them back but we're gonna have us a fish fry and all that so i might go riding or something i don't know just, just a little vlog video yeah i don't know if i'll use that trashy trashy pole right there it's it's an old pole it's kind of wore out or i don't know if i should stop being lazy and take the bobber off this pole and just put some little jig on there find out something okay guys so i was riding you know just looking and i seen a big old pretty good size i don't know i don't know if it was a bass or a grinnel i really don't know it looked like a bass and it looked like a grinnel you know but to me i think it was a bass you know so heck and i seen him he swam over there and i cast my bait out there you know and uh he disappeared and then when i when I was reeling up, I could see my bait in the water, and here he comes swimming up. But I was too close to the weeds, and I had to reel it out, or I get hung up, and he'd swim away. And I threw out there where he was heading, and I don't know where he went. So I'm just trying to out here. I'm just trying to find him out here, you know, guys. But that's a big old fish, and if I've caught it, and it was a big old bass, uh, I'd bring him home, man. We skin him, and I, we, I think we'd add him to the pile of the fish fry we're having. We, yeah. We, it don't take long to skin a fish out. My dad cuts the sides, and I, I take my old trusty old skinny knife, or one of his old knives, and I skin, I cut the meat, bad meat, uh, bad part off, and I keep the good meat. I, I skin the meat out, okay? Just, sorry, I have trouble with some words, I guess. But it looks like I ain't gonna get to find them, you know? And I was gonna go down there to... There's an iron bridge down here. I'll probably get the 
And I could usually go underneath that bridge and catch some crappie underneath the bridge, you know. But heck, there's people down there talking, so I ain't fishing down there. And you got duck hunters over here that's on their day gun full world. But yeah, I see them down there. Yeah, I see them. There they go heading out. Looks like there's a ranger in front of them, and look like they're boat. I don't know, they're going fishing somewhere. But yeah. Yeah, it looks like I ain't gonna get to find them, so I guess I'll move on. I'm just using this green and black jig on this, uh, this just throwing the ranger and go fishing pole. Uh, it's kind of a piece of junk. Well, no, it's not really. It actually works pretty good, you know, but it's it's a Mr. Crappie. They're very good poles. I shouldn't have called it a piece of junk. It actually works pretty good. This is actually one of my favorite poles, or this is the pole the, that I use the most, you know. But yeah, I just want that's what I'm using. But and I also seen a gar. I didn't have the camera on. I seen the gar. I was gonna try to catch it just for for a uh, clout or whatever. But uh, yeah, he didn't see it and almost got hung up. But uh, yeah, we're finally gonna move out of here. We're gonna probably move to that little bridge over there. Or uh, you'll see. There's like three more bass over there. It's a, he's a I'd say he's a keeper. I'm gonna give my dad a call. And see if he want if I can keep some. I didn't bring nothing to put them in. He, he probably would say just throw them back, but heck, I'm yeah, I'll probably just throw them back. So I'm gonna give me give him a call real quick. Well, guys, uh, he, he said just throw them back. It's because the fact that I didn't bring nothing to keep them in, you know. There's still four more out there, or like, I still see them. They're swimming out there. I see them in the water. So I'm just gonna stay here and catch me a few bass, you know. Wish I could freaking keep them, though. Goodness, I wish I brought some. I wish I brought my net, my fishing net, if I knew I was gonna catch some. <sighs> Heck, I was just out here vlogging, just having a good old time, but I didn't know I was gonna actually catch a dang gun bass. Man, I could catch all five of them and bring them home and I have more to, to fish. Well, I bet I threw like 15 more times. I didn't catch nothing. I seen them like a while ago, well, just a little bit ago. I seen them swimming over there, and I threw right over top of them, like right behind them, and they swirled off, and they got scared, you know. And, uh, yeah, yeah, I don't know where they went. So, uh, yeah, I guess I'll just go to the house or whatever. Uh, I'm kind of thirsty anyway. Plus, I don't want to make this video too long because... The longer the video, the longer it takes to upload. And uh, I ain't got that good service, really. Uh, some places I do, but I don't know, it just takes a long time. But, uh, yeah. Uh, my, dad, my dad's getting the fish ready to cook, you know. So uh, I gotta figure out what the name of the video. But, yeah, uh, as I said earlier in this video, go check out my buddy's YouTube channel. Uh, jake roberts uh, go subscribe to him like his videos and uh go check out skeet scott too go uh go check his youtube out youtube channel out and subscribe hit the like button for him too and uh yeah see y'all back at the house well guys this is going to wrap it up for the video this is my fish my plate and uh here's what all we cut we cut cheese sticks uh uh, onion rings and uh, hush puppies and uh, some uh, spicy, uh, I don't figure out what those are, uh, jalapeno popper things. And here's the fr fr uh, the fish and french fries. Yeah, that's some good eating right there. But yeah, that's good. That's going to wrap it up for the, today's video. Hope you all enjoyed. If you like this kind of content, give me a, give me a subscribe and give me a like and uh, comment down below. What else you want to see on my YouTube channel? All right, peace out, y'all.